What's up, everybody? Afro Joe here, telling like it is. Now, the guy that you see in front of you, yes, I know you, I'm a little bit late on the videos, but I've been busy. But the guy you see in front of you, his name is Curtis Reeves, a retired police officer, getting charged with second degree murder for shooting a guy. This man, Olsen, I think his name was Olsen, for texting on the phone. The woman beside her is his wife, and she got shot in the hand. The reason why the guy got shot is because he was texting to see how his daughter was doing. Which is why her face is blurred. I was sitting up there, I was like, I said that when I heard this story, I was like, y'all guys to be joking with me. You're telling me that this retired popo, this retired police officer, dude, shot and killed a man because he was checking up on his child. Am I missing something here, ladies and gentlemen? What the hell is going on here? A man shoots and kills somebody because he was texting on the phone just to see how his daughter's doing. The movie hasn't even started. And he goes off and shoots the guy. Now, y'all probably saying it's like, some people say, oh, he deserved it. Some say he, he didn't deserve it. To me, I see it like this. I see both sides of the story. A, for one, I say he didn't deserve it because one thing is, he's a father. Now the man would never see his daughter grow up. He would never see his daughter get married and have kids because of what happened. That's one. And I sat there and I thought that is like the dirtiest shit to, to ever do to somebody. It's kill them and take them away from a child. The second thing is, if, the second thing is when he shot and killed the when he, to me it's like is, if you he I heard what they said was he already talked to the guy said please can you please stop texting. He did the right thing for saying that, but one thing about this is it's it's like this. <laughs> It's like this. If some, if you know, if somebody's texting her on the phone, do the right thing, move to another seat. That's all you need to do was move to another seat, because shooting somebody over something so petty is stupid. He shot and killed this guy because he was on the cell phone t uh, texting to see how his daughter was doing. He shot and killed this man because to see how he wanted to see how his daughter was doing. He wanted to sit and. He said he threw popcorn at him. Also, he tried to use that as a fence. It's like, for real? You shouldn't kill this man because he threw popcorn at you and he was trying to see, text. He was texting the babysitter or somebody to see how his daughter was doing, his three year old daughter. It's like, that's fucked up. Like, why would you like to me? Why? 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 That is like so retarded. Why out of out of out of things that go out of everything that goes on in the world, he's a retired police officer. He shoots and kills a man because he was on the phone. And he threw popcorn at him. Like, are you for real, man? That you were shooting? That you carry a loaded weapon? Like, for real? Didn't you learn anything about when that James Holm character shot and killed? Went off in there and shot and killed some people. I guess he did, man. I guess he didn't. I guess he fucking didn't. I guess he. I guess he didn't, man. Shoots and kill a father on oh, nothing. And I'm sitting up here, it's like, oh my god, that is so damn petty. Over and, and, and they say they're charging this retired officer, uh, Curtis Reeves, uh, manslaughter, second, uh, manslaughter two. I said, nah, this, so whatever, this, this guy needs to be, like, to me, he needs to be in prison for doing that. He shot him in over cell phone and popcorn 
which made no sense to to do is to shoot a man over fucking popcorn and a fucking cell phone. What's the world coming to you? What's the world coming to? Well, we just had a fuck. We had a shooting down in New Mexico, Roswell, New Mexico, and then you get some crazy ass man sitting up there shooting somebody in the damn theater. For real. Well, what the world's coming to you, man? You can't go to the movies while somebody was shooting you. Can't go to school without some without your kids. Can't go to school without somebody shooting them. What can you do? Nothing. Nothing. I'm sitting up here questioning stuff. Man, she was a man. This retired police officer shoots a man. I was like, that, that, that makes no sense that you would do something like that. And I don't get it. I don't get it. That's one thing I'm trying to figure out. It's like, why? Why? 2014 and the year is still fresh. And it's still fresh. And you shoot and kill. Somebody over something so petty. Which I don't get. Which I don't get. Over some damn popcorn. And a damn cell phone. Of a popcorn and their cell phone. But you know what though, man? This dude needs life in prison. This dude needs life in prison for shooting this guy. Killing him. This man will never see his daughter grow up. This man would never see his daughter graduate from high school. This man would never sit there see his child graduate from college. This man would never walk his daughter down the aisle because of this man, this Curtis Reeves. Stand your girl my ass. What kind of shit is that? You get one man you get one man to shoot some father and guess and he's getting shot like you see this one man get shot a father and he's getting charged with second degree mother murder this is down in Florida now this is down in Florida the same state that this man right here got off for killing a damn 17 year old boy I said, hold on, when I heard this, I was like, hold on, hold on, hold on. You telling me this white man, this retired police officer, he's charged with second degree murder, manslaughter. And he looked like he and he looked like he about to get life in prison for shooting a guy in the po shooting a guy in the theater. This man shoots somebody in the damn gated community and he's sitting up there walking sky high getting to hurt anybody he wants. Tell, tell me something I'm missing. Well, I'm sorry if I said white men, but tell, race doesn't doesn't matter. But tell me when am I missing? How come this man shoots a 17 year old kid and get away with murder, but this man right here shoots this man, but he getting charged for manslaughter, second degree manslaughter? You tell me something I'm not missing. Why is he getting charged for second degree manslaughter, but this man's walking the street? You tell me something I don't know. And it happened right down in Florida, the same state that says, Stand your ground law, stand your ground law, stand your ground law. This man gets to walk free from shooting a 17 year old. This man gets second degree manslaughter for shooting a damn man in the theater. That's something I don't get. You tell me something I'm missing. If this man can get charged with second degree murder, and look, I say like this: 
if this man is found guilty of murder in the second degree, Florida is going to be in a lot of shit because this man got away with the murder. But if he does it and he's getting, he's found guilty, Florida, y'all better kiss this shit goodbye because y'all about to go to hell in the handbasket. And for real, man, if you go to a the theater, turn off your damn cell phones, man. It says it right in the theater when the movie starts. It says, please turn off your cell phone. No talking, no texting. Right in the damn, right in the damn, right when the movie's beginning. They even put signs up. It says, turn your cell phone off. If the theater's telling you to turn your cell phone off, then turn it off. Because one thing is, you don't want to go through what this man went through. Now this man is dead. His wife, his wife is beautiful. She gets shot in the hand. That's kind of fucked up. This man ain't won't get to see his child grow up, but like that kid. A cell phone is not something you want to lose your life over. But this man thinks <laughs> shooting somebody is better. It's, it's something to do. But this has been Afro Joe Tell like T.I. is. Tell me what you think on this. You think this man deserved to ride in prison? Or do you think this man needs to run free? Like George Zimmerman. You tell me. George Zimmerman. George Zimmerman shoots a kid and gets away with murder. He shoots somebody in the theater. He's getting charged with second degree murder. Tell me something out of missing. What does Z2 story has something in common? And I can tell you, tell you this, they're both in Florida, both stay in your ground laws, and they both shot somebody, and both of them are dead. Same, they have, that's what they have in common. But Afro, this has been Afro Joe, tell like a T.A. You tell me what you think. Follow me on Twitter, Afro Joe the Wookie. Subscribe to my channel, CeeLo Jr. 2, CeeLo Jr. 3. Follow me on Tumblr, and tell me what the fuck you think. Peace, love, and Afro-Greece.